top story we are following here on India today. The first images of the drones that were used in Operation Sindhu. Army chief monitors the loitering of munitions counters. Witness precision engagement of the drones. The Army General Lupin Dwivedi witnessed the cutting edge demonstration of the indigenous UAS, the counter UAS and the loitering munitions. Capabilities will significantly enhance the operational efficiency of the Indian Army. My colleague Shivani Sharma is now joining me on the story. Shivani, what we can see, the precision engagement of the drones and drones were the ones who played a very crucial role in Operation Sindhur. As well as General Open the way, has witnessed the cutting edge uh, demonstrations of these indigenous unarmed aerial systems and the counter unarmed aerial system technologies that Army possesses. He also saw the loitering munitions at uh, the Babira field firing ranges on Tuesday. And these advanced capabilities, including the use of ultra light precision guided munitions, mark a significant leap in the Indian Army's pursuit to in, enhance its technological warfare. And remember, the relevance of these systems has been recently understood during Operation Sindhur, where the Army effectively deployed these UAS for real-time surveillance and counter UAS to neutralize the aerial threats that came in from Pakistan. So loitering munitions were used for precision strikes at the enemy positions, and these are the capabilities on which Army has been focusing in the recent years. Right, thank you, Shivani, giving us those details. As my colleague was also pointing out, enhancing India's capabilities. That's something that the Defence Forces have been working towards. And what you just saw were those special drones that were being used in Operation Sindhu. Precision strikes, that's something that India is now looking at acing. And that's how Operation Sindhu was conducted.